last day. This is the last day we spent down this climb. It's been a great climb. We've found a lot of beautiful opal in here. This particular day we went down and had a good look around, one last big look, and there was no trace really anywhere. Cracks in the roof you can stick your arm into, just starts feeling very dangerous. Time to, you know, get out of there, and get out to a new claim on Olympic and see what we can round up. So we're just gonna replace these old plates. Expired a couple of years ago. some brand spankers. There it is. It cost about 97 bucks, I think it was, just to get a new set of plates. So these are going around our claim on Olympia. Don't have Olympic, try again. Jump out and see if we can get the machine through the shaft. Maybe. Trying to avoid drilling a uh, tunnel machine hole cost many thousands of dollars and there's no one to drill it anyway. Well, let's see if we can get it in without doing it. Just taking a new claim on Olympic. Here we are going to find probably several million dollars. You guys get to witness it. Get a dream. Off. We're trying to find a way to uh, get the machine through here from this tunnel machine hole through to where we're mining a long way from here. So that looks like a decent hole. Back with a crane could get us down this far. Um, that's an interesting area. A lot of potter in this claim on Olympic. And then we're heading back that way to where we're mining. Almost uh, 200 meters. Let's get the pick out and start having a scratch. You just never know. But I'm not that excited about this, but I'll check this years ago. Oh, here we go. Should go around. Okay. And, ooh, danger. Oh, what? Someone's gone down really deep there. Oh my goodness. Where are we? Out this way? Perhaps? Nope. That's a dead end. Do you have to say dead? Oh. Anyway. It turns out this dead end um, was only a dead end on the top level. And Shannon had crawled across from another hole that I couldn't get through because I'd stuffed up my hip. Um, but that one was on the bottom level, went all the way through, connected to our other claim. And I was wondering where he was the whole time, but uh, yeah, we figured it out in the end. Okay. That does not connect to anything. What are we doing, Nico? Registering Olympic. Is that my registration? No. You want to take a photo of this one? That's a million dollar claim. Is that correct? <laughs> You'd want to hope so. Oh, I'm holding you, you to know, it. You can, you can certainly all dream right. about it. All right. Well, I'll come back and uh, complain if it's not, all right? <laughs> <laughs> complaints. Complaints are over here. Yes. Jackie. Complaints are at right. Jackie. <laughs> no worries. A meter, I know. Yeah, yeah. You move think, it a meter in a straight line from the...
She's a cold one. On the opal fields. Over a big dangerous shaft. Yeah, that's the Just love these beautiful mornings in Cooper Bay. We're gonna go have a look around and jump down a hole or two and see what we can scratch up. We're gonna do a bit of pillow bashing here on on Olympic. See how it looks. Good danger here so we have to be careful. See if we can come up with anything. Well, we climbed around for about an hour or so and the ballroom's just got really maggoty and we just could barely move in there and someone's been in there with a black light as well so there's not really any point in continuing but, you know, it's a young man's game climbing around on Olympic hoping to find some, you know, you need to be able to shift dirt to see where the colour is. Everything's been thrashed so we're getting out of here. Oh, you feel better? Oh yeah, I feel better now that I've climbed down the shaft on the winch. You hurt me beer. <laughs> Wonderful thing. Oh my god. Oh you yeah. absolute legend. See, when these guards are hammered in hard enough that the thing doesn't pop out, occasionally when it does pop out, it's very hard to get back in. So it's one of those things where I keep it just in that spot. Uh, trick is not to let it pop out, obviously. Oh my God. So. How's the width? Yeah, it's alright, yeah, it's tight, but it's between the car and the bar. Oh, yeah. Oh, absolutely, okay. This will be full, won't it? Like, you fill this up. It will, but it'll be easier. Well, as long as you've got the car, it won't take too long. All we can do is do a straight drive. Yep. Well, if you're encouraged, you can do it. Let's do it! It's alright, let's do it. Let's smash it. See, I remember Alex had buckets of trace that he dug in here. Oh, we've got turning around spot here. It's ultimate, man. All right. I think there's... Oh, it might be parallel. Well, I don't think it is. It's hard to tell from here, but I think that vertical is being fed by something else. It's huge, man. It's massive material. Look at the size of that stuff. What happens when that gets closer to the slide, the other slide? This, these verticals are feeding in... Maybe they are a long way from the slide, but I reckon, you know, like all up inside there, closer to that slide, whatever is happening and influencing in there, that's what we've got to be. Well, yeah, I haven't been here. I haven't. What the hell is this? Unless there's, unless there's another. Another slide here that we haven't seen, but I don't know. Yeah, Hang on, what's this? Oh, we're on flaming huge. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's colour shells here and yeah. stunning crystal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't hurt my blood. I'm gonna hurt my freaking hip doing this. Yeah, I'm just trying to get somewhere to stand. That's almost cuttable. Fix the level. Yeah. Beautiful colour.
Beautiful color. Red. Thought we'd go for a wander down on old Seven Mile in this cut. This is done to break through into a, one of the richest runs that have ever been found in Kirpiti, which we'll show you in a little while. But right through here, you can see all the walls have just collapsed and very dangerous areas, but the opal from here was absolutely like Kirpiti's Andamuka, South Pacific, old Seven Mile. Beautiful foot. Oh, and have a look. I've got a good shot of um, all the legends, talking the legends. Oh, good. You can't really tell how big it is in the video, but it's gargantuous. It is all of the backfill. Yeah, right? it's been run out now, so it's still going. Yeah. This is a bit of lovely halfway hill material we managed to buy. We're going to slice this and uh, end up in our stores and jewellery. Absolutely beautiful material. And this is a bit of seven mile material, South Pacific. Again, beautiful, strong material. Here's a bit more of it. We managed to pick up a parcel of this. There'll be rubs of this available at Grace Opal. And uh, this one too, I'm not sure. We might have sliced that up for jewellery. These uh, will be available as rubs on Grace Opal. So keep an eye out for beautiful jewellery made of this stuff coming to these stores.